factor in the upcoming presidential race. Congress is already taking steps to increase funding for veterans, and Colorado Congresswoman Diana DeGette outlined some key legislation this morning. CBS 4's Michelle Griego joins us now from the Veterans Hospital with the details. Michelle? Well, Tom, Congresswoman, just start off the day by thanking Colorado veterans for their service to the country. She also called on the Senate to follow the House's lead in passing key priorities for Colorado veterans. She says so far Congress has passed legislation that rebuilds the military. That includes providing more equipment, body armor, and training for the troops. It also provides adequate health care benefits for troops and their families, and also calling on a 3.5 percent pay raise. Now, Congresswoman Deget announced a letter that she and three other Colorado Democrats are sending to the Senate leadership to pass remaining priorities. One of them is a bill that will authorize the largest ever increase in veterans funding. This bill does two things. It provides funding for urgent health uh, care needs of our ailing Colorado veterans and funding for the, for the thousands of do VA caseworkers to help reduce the unconscionable delays that separate vets from the care they need. And some of that urgent health care benefits including, includes providing support for post-traumatic stress disorder, also prosthetics for those veterans needing it when returning from war. The letter that Congresswoman DeGette did talk about should be sent out sometime today. Tom? All right, thank you, Michelle.